everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing something a little different. Um, it's not makeup, beauty, any type of that stuff related. Um, I actually have been interested in subscription boxes lately and the first one that I got, it's this one, that's a big one, um, is Kindergarten Crate. I am a kindergarten teacher and I think this stuff is really cool. It is more of an expensive, um, subscription box. I think it's like $40 a month, but I will list all the information down below and a link where you can go check it out for no, you'll get it at the end of November for December. So this is the one that I got at the end of October for November. So I'm just going to pull it out, show you what I got, show you what I think about the things. And yeah, I hope you like this kind of different style video today. So the first thing in this box was the wooden story blocks. Um, this looked cool actually, I'm sorry, there's like not a lot of natural lighting, so I'm using um, like lights, so there's kind of like a weird glare. But these looked cool, um, it's like blue is who, red what, green where, orange when, and you can kind of roll them and tell a story and yeah, I don't know. I think this would be good for my kids. I think they'll like this a lot. Next are these Ticonderoga golf pencils, a whole big bunch of them. I don't know how many, 72 of them. These are really good for practicing writing in the beginning of the school year because they're good for like fine motor and they're also just fun. The kids think they're different and fun, so I'm excited about these. Um, I'm thinking maybe I'll do like a write the room with them or something, something like that. I think the dog just ran into the door. Next are these um, word strips. These are probably the item that I'm least excited about because they are from the dollar store. Like I know this brand, I go get it all the time. But I mean, you can always use sentence strips. So it'll be fine. I don't know what I'm gonna use them for exactly, but I'll find a use for them. Next, there are Silly Scents from Crayola. And the one I'm actually really interested in is Fresh Air, so hold on. It's like the light blue. It's supposed to smell like fresh air. It kind of smells like Febreze, like, you know, the Febreze flavor that's like laundry detergent or whatever, but these are fun. Um, you get 12 in this pack, and this is definitely something that I would like to use when I'm, you know, doing an anchor chart or something like that. This is probably not something I would necessarily give to the kids. Um, they always include like a little gift for the teacher, so this month it is some fuzzy socks, and I love fuzzy socks, so I'm probably going to put these on as soon as I'm done filming this. Um, I've been saving everything in this box for like a few days now, so now I can finally get these bad boys out and wear them, but um, love fuzzy socks. And then they always have a lesson to go along with the story. So the story is The Thankful Book by Todd Parr. Um, I like this, it has nice bright pictures, it's nice that it's a hardcover, and it's cute because one of the pages, let me find where it is. The kids are going to love this page. It says, I am thankful for underwear because I like to wear it on my head. They're just going to eat that up. So, yeah, that's a nice book. And then the whole lesson to go along with it gives you this storytelling paper pad. And the kids are supposed to write, I am thankful for blank because blank. Like, I am thankful for my dog because she sleeps with me at night. The only thing is, is I don't think my kids can write that long of a sentence, so I'm probably going to have to write, I am thankful for, have them write that, then I'll write because, and um, they can finish up the sentence because their writing skills, you know. That's a long sentence to write, and a lot of words and a lot of letters, so yeah, but I like this idea, so these two go together. And then the last thing is just a paper that describes what's in this box. Um, really nice quality paper. Um, the theme this month was the thankful box for Thanksgiving. Um, it describes 
the teacher gift, the supplies, and the activity, which is the book and the sentence writing. And then it gives a sneak peek at next month's box, and it says it's going to be a shirt month. So it's looking like gingerbread something, something from Crayola, and I'm assuming that's like a hint at what the shirt is going to look like. So yeah, um, if you want to sign up for the subscription box, I will leave a link down below. I think it's fun, not only just for kindergarten teachers, but for parents of younger kids. It's just kind of something to do at home that isn't the same old thing, you know. Um, I know a lot of parents like to give their kids like workbooks and things like that because they are trying to work on school skills at home, but I think that this is kind of a better idea because it kind of expands and gives you more ideas. So yeah, if you are a parent or a teacher, um, I think this would work probably for maybe pre-K and first grade as well as kindergarten. So yeah, you might want to check this out. Um, I hope you enjoyed this kind of different video. Let me know what you thought if you'd like to see this again. Next month I have some other subscription boxes coming that are more beauty related. So I'll be doing those soon on here too. And yeah, I hope you have a great day. Make sure you subscribe, check out my blog, check out my Instagram and everything like that. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.